Do you also want the secret mantra on how to solve inequality questions accurately and correctly in exams? Then you have selected the correct video to watch. Hello everyone, I am Pratiksha Agarwal who will teach you this secret mantra. All you have to do is watch this video till the end and don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Now let's quickly start the video. So this is how the questions look like. The question looked like, first of all, let me read this for you. Study the following information to answer the given questions. First, we are going to decode these symbols. Okay. For example, A dollar B means A is not smaller than, is not smaller than B, which means A is greater than or equal to B. So here dollar sign means greater than or equal to. A at the rate B means A is neither smaller than nor equal to B which means a is greater than b. Now a hashtag b means a is neither greater than nor equal to b. So a is smaller than b because a is not greater than b and also a is not equal to b. So a is smaller than b. a and b means a is neither greater than nor smaller than b. So certainly a is equal to b. A asterisk B means A is not greater than B, which means A is smaller than or equal to B. So these different signs of inequality were coded in these symbols and here I have decoded these uh, symbols, the meaning of these symbols I have explained here. Now let's see the first question based on this. So this is the first question. Here the statements are given in the coded form. And students, for your convenience, I have provided this table. Uh, from here, you can see the symbol and also the meaning. So, first of all, we have to do is we have to decode these statement, okay, and write it in simple inequality form. So, O and A. And means equal to. Here you can see equal to. And means equal to. So, O and A means O is equal to A. A dollar R. Dollar means greater than or equal to. So which means A is greater than or equal to R. R hashtag S. Here hashtag means smaller than. Which means R is smaller than S. Now S asterisk Q. So here asterisk means smaller than or equal to. So S is smaller than or equal to Q. So now we have decoded this statement in the simple inequality form and this form I have told in the first part. Those who haven't watched that uh, first part, I will provide the link in the description. Do watch that video also. Now let's see the conclusion. The first conclusion is Q at the rate R. Here at the rate means greater than. So Q greater than R. Here you can see that this is Q and this is R. While traveling from Q to R, you can see that yes, Q is greater than R. So our conclusion number one is right. Now second conclusion is S at the rate O. At the rate means greater than. So S is greater than O. Now when we are traveling from S to O, here we encounter these two symbols, okay, whose mouths are open in the opposite direction. So, no relation can be set up between S and O. Therefore, conclusion 2 is wrong. Now, let's move to conclusion 3. R and O. Here, and means equal to. So, R and O. Here, see, you can see here, O is greater than or equal to R. So, I am going to write this conclusion here because now I have to explain a concept to you students here it is given that r okay is equal to o now the fourth uh, conclusion it is given r hashtag o hashtag means smaller than so the fourth conclusion is r is less than o okay now, if we see from this to this in the question, you can see here, we can write it, write it like this, R is smaller than or equal to O. Yes, 
and students these state conclusion 3 and 4 if we merge them it becomes this means r is either see the statement itself says that r is either smaller than o or r is equal to o means r is either smaller than or equal to o okay so which means uh, conclusion uh, in conclusion 3 and 4 either or will be used either conclusion 3 or conclusion 4 and conclusion 1 is correct see here left left hand side is same and right hand side is also same and when we have merged these two symbols it becomes this lesser than or equal or equal to which is given in the question r is smaller than or equal to o is already given in the statement and statement is always true and on merging conclusion 3 and 4 we get this so our answer will be either conclusion 3 and 4 or sorry either conclusion 3 or 4 and conclusion 1 is true sorry are true so here it is given here in option number e either 3 or 4 and 1 are true i hope this much is clear to everyone still if you have any doubt do comment me i'll try to solve it now let's check the answer see we got the correct answer students let's proceed to the next question so this is the next question and here also first we are going to decode this so e hashtag m means e hashtag means smaller than which is e is smaller than m m asterisk n asterisk means smaller than or equal to so m is smaller than or equal to n n a, n at the rate o at the rate means greater than which means n is greater than o now o dollar p dollar means greater than or equal to so o is greater than or equal to p okay now let's see the conclusion so first is p hashtag m so hashtag means smaller than p is smaller than m so here students while traveling from p to m we encounter two symbols whose mouths are open in different direction which means there can be no relation between p and m so our conclusion one is wrong now let's see conclusion two it's p hashtag n hashtag means smaller than p is smaller than n so you can see that yes conclusion 2 is correct when we travel from p to n we see that mouth is open towards n so n will be greater than p or you can say that p is smaller than n so yes our conclusion 2 is absolutely correct okay now the third is m hashtag m hashtag o hashtag means smaller than now m is smaller than o when traveling from M to O, we again encounter these two symbols whose mouths are open in different direction. So, no relation between M and O. So, conclusion 3 is wrong. Now, the conclusion 2, sorry, conclusion 4 says N at the rate E. At the rate means greater than. So, N is greater than E. You can see here clearly that N is greater than E. So, our conclusion uh, 4 is also correct. So, conclusion 2 and conclusion 4 are correct. Let's see which is given in, uh, in the option. It is given in option number B. 2 and 4 are true. So, let's check the answer. See, we got the correct answer students. Let's proceed to the next question. Let's first decode this. A dollar E means A is greater than or equal to E. E at the rate F, at the rate means greater than, which means E is greater than F. F asterisk G, asterisk means smaller than or equal to, so F is smaller than or equal to G. And G hashtag H, hashtag means smaller than, then G is smaller than H. Okay, now let's see the conclusions. The first is A at the rate E, at the rate means greater than, so H is greater than E. Here you can see that while traveling from H to E, we encounter these two symbols whose mouths are open, open in different directions. So, no relation between H and E, hence conclusion 1 is wrong. Conclusion 2 says A dollar G, dollar means greater than or equal to. So, 
A is here and G is here and while traveling from A to G again we encounter these two uh, symbols whose mouths are open in different direction so no relation between A and G okay now conclusion third is E at the rate H at the rate means greater than so E is greater than H C while traveling from E to H again the same problem uh, and we encounter again the same problem these two symbols whose mouths are open in different direction so no relation between E and H so conclusion 3 is also wrong conclusion 4 is A at the rate F at the rate means greater than so you can see here while traveling from A to F you can clearly see that A is greater than F so our conclusion 4 is correct so only conclusion 4 is true in this question and which is given in option number E. Let's check the answer. See, our answer is correct. So students, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any query, please comment me. I'll try to solve it. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe my channel. Bye-bye. Thank you.